Yeah, um, everybody's entitled to their opinion, but that crazy woman from the States has to remember that people are watching this that do have family that have um, passed away or they have no belongings anymore or, you know, they've got nothing. Their house is gone and their boat's gone and they can't go out fishing anymore because there's bloody toxic waste out there and, you know, they lost everything. And it, it's kind of heartless, you know, to go saying rubbish like that. I mean, her little occult got a lot of um, flack in the States because she was, you know, her, I don't know, crazy grandma with a bushed out hair was standing outside and saying, oh, thank God for AIDS and pedophiles and all the rest of it, you know, but it's it's just mental people. They've, they've been abused as children or, um, I don't know, they've, they've had a lot of a lot of terrible things I, I can't imagine, you know, I've been brought up half decent, but, you know, jeez, keep it away from the rest of us, woman, you know, I think um, you should, I don't know, go out and get some sunlight, you look a bit pasty, yeah, but anyway, my, my heart really goes out to the Japanese, and, um, and for the New Zealanders, and also for any other country that's been affected by these quakes, and I'm sure this is not the last of it, um, so, she better watch her little mouth because it might be heading around to her neck of the woods. Um, yeah, you know, you've got to show a bit of compassion. I mean, we were taught in Sunday school and all the rest of it that um, God is not a not that kind of God. You know, he, he he's a, he's a good good and loving person, and he sent down one of his disciples, and he taught nothing but love, forgiveness, and you know, yeah, well, I never, never heard of any of that. But it's, you know, it's, it's, it's not time to to bring in, you know, religions into this sort of horrible thing. I mean, we've got to remember that we're on a big ball of floating magma and we're spinning around the the sun at such a high velocity. I mean, it's a very unstable planet, but it seems to be the most beautiful place in the whole universe for us. It's perfect. I mean, yeah. But for the Japanese, want on the kawaii on there, yeah, in. Uh, and for the, the New Zealanders, it, it's terrible, you know, people losing their their homes and yeah, it's just a horrible thing. But like I said, it's probably not the end because we're living on a planet and pe people like that woman sort of come out of you know lack of community and interaction with other other people you know because we lost that and that's what's given us these inflated egos and, and lack of empathy is the community and um, just people interacting because the good things the good things come out when when you're in a big group of people and you can interact anyway um, yeah I, I feel sorry for that woman but now you can't help being an utter, I suppose. Anyway.